Isn't it amazing, hey? Now, uh, as you can see, Alex has just joined me, but I must just say, I've seen the green smoke over there, which means we are good to fly this evening. We thought so, didn't we? It's amazing weather. We yeah, everybody's so been talking about the weather over the last couple of days. It has been perfect for the spectators and also for ballooning. It's just been yeah. a great day. I must just bring up the fact that you were in the Minions balloon that took out the sun, which meant... Basically, the solar balloon went whoop. I know, I'm not completely responsible, but I did feel a bit guilty when we were flying alongside each other. We blocked the sun and then literally <laughs> the solar balloon just dropped oh dear. way below us. Yeah. But you were on that balloon. Tell me about it. Oh, it was a great flight this morning. Just absolutely spectacular. We couldn't have asked for better weather. And as Kylie says, we've got the green smoke uh, just to the left of me. That means we're going to be flying again this evening as well. The balloons above me are bashing into each other, raring to go. But this morning, boy, was it spectacular. Well, the time is 6 o'clock in the morning. The weather has behaved itself overnight, so all the balloonists are unpacking their balloons. The mist is still lying around, but hopefully that should lift and we're going to have a great flight. And this is my balloon, the Minions. God, they got an early start, didn't they? In fact, it was an early start for all 150 balloonists here at Ashton Court, trying to catch the calmest winds across the city. Although getting the balloon up takes a strong wind powered by a big fan, you think a weatherman would be used to being blown around. Well, this is my first time actually inside a balloon. It is absolutely amazing. To be honest with you, I'm a bit nervous about staying in here too long because, Jamie, I think we should get out of here before it actually lifts up. <laughs> While the Minion is practically up, we are literally moments away of taking to the skies. With four bottles of gas, a presenter and a film crew on board, it was time to say boobie to Ashton Court. Translation, goodbye in Minion talk. I have been in a balloon before, but it doesn't matter how many times you go, you always get excited. The weather conditions are perfect, the winds are quite light, which is why the balloons are moving very, very slowly, which is good because we'll probably stay up a bit longer as well. Nick, as weather conditions go, is this the perfect ballooning weather? About as good as it gets. I've been flying at the Fiesta since 87, and I think this is the best slot. Really? Yeah. It's just amazing, isn't it? I mean, yeah. you must have flown over Bristol many times. I have, And yeah. I've been a few times as well, but it just never gets boring. Seeing your home city yeah. from the air, it's and also at this height. Yeah. The only thing about ballooning is that it can be a bit unpredictable as to where you land. Lots of the balloons are landing on the golf course just behind me. We've just missed it, so currently, we're looking for a new field. Oh, there's one, Nick. Where are we? Barrow Gurney, just by Barrow Tanks. Oh. Before the airport, before the Ryanair that's just landed. <laughs> <laughs> just wait for the crew now to come and pick us up. Have I really got a pack this balloon away. I mean, Jamie, I'm a presenter. Why do I have to do this? That's not my problem. You sort it out yourself. What is the point right, when I've got my minions? Come on, chop, chop. Come on, do some work. <laughs> <laughs> well, I can promise you that I did help pack the minion away. It's starting to go up now. Again, another flight, as I say. And the organisers here, they're quite hopeful that they may get six or seven ascents over the next couple of days because the weather is looking pretty good. We've got high pressure starting to build in from the west and northwest over the next couple of days. So whether you're coming to look at the balloons or just kind of mooch around and have a great time, I don't think you're going to need your brolly. Let's take a look at the forecast.